There's a lot of different ways that you can open coconuts, right? Um, one that I just like to have out here. I've is. never had these on the beach. <laughs> a machete. Why? A machete. Why? Why? Just in oh, case, wow. Listen, in case a zombie apocalypse breaks <laughs> out right now. You never know. Here's how you're going to open up a, a coconut to get the juice out. First things first. You don't is You'll throw notice it. that coconuts, and this is an aged, mature coconut. It's sort of got a little face on it, right? It's got a little face it on does. it. It These three dots. And if you want to just get the juice out of it, you can find your ice pick up here. Oh my gosh. And you want to find what is one of the softer sort of dots in there, right? Okay. Soft oh, dots. wow. Yeah, look at that. that. That happened fast. There you go. Did you oh get it already? Yeah, wow. Oh, so yeah. Quick. You didn't even use your hat. Did you use the hammer at all? No, I didn't, but I have my goggles okay. on. And you can Did sort of somebody just... puncture our hole? I think you're doing the wrong right. hole, so there you man. go. So you, you got that. You yeah. pop that out there. Okay. Right? And then to, you want to get a little airflow, so do another, another side of it as well. So there you go. Boom. That one's really okay. easy. Oh, mine's and not. See, that only one was easy. That's how you can start pouring out some of your juice out of the coconut, right? Okay, now listen, aged coconuts. Are you listening at all, Ben, by you the ever, way? Do you ever put the lime in the coconut, then mix it all up? I, I, yeah. All right, now, while you guys are doing that, here's the way that I like See, to do I'm it. I'm used to, like, having the <laughs> straw already in there. That's, how, that's a good way to do it, too. This when is you're a lot super, of work. When you're this super one made famous me like you. Buzz. Listen, first thing, guys, also, I forgot to tell this. You yes, have a little so. wet rag yeah. near you. Yeah. You want to put that on your cutting board. And that will keep your, your coconut in place. Oh, so okay. Slide That's why it wasn't. Kelly, working. I'm concerned about you. You might want to put your, oh. your, your towel underneath your board. Kay. Now, here's how I like to open up. Coconut also oh, has my God, these three Freddy seams. Kruger. Okay, yeah. Okay. Right? These three seams, and they're pretty obvious where these seams are. <laughs> and to cr crack a coconut in half, what you want to do is tap these seams. I'm going to use the back side of a meat cleaver. You guys can use your hammer. Kay. Right, so put I it this way, right? You got it, Kelly, just like this? Chopstick. Yeah, okay. We're going to use the hammer, um, Kelly. We're, we're going to okay. put it this way. There. Wait. Oh. You show off. He's a show off. Wow, you're so strong. He's such okay, the a back, show off. Wait, you just the hit back the end. side? Yep. There we go. You say the back end of the hammer, yep. that's that. Yeah, the back end. Now oh, you have you're, a bikini. You use your side. Okay. <laughs> there, there's mine. Okay, so Ben, you got yours, but Ben. All your juice is oh on the board. My, my okay. coconut water fell out, yeah. OK, do you want to hey. use the mallet? Yeah. Okay, no, no, just you, use the, I mean, use the back side of the cleaner. I feel like that's not the thing, though. Okay. Watch you your go. faces. OK, you're you good. You don't have your safety give it, goggles give it a good, on. Give it a, I should now. You're right. Yeah. This is a good time to put goggles on. OK, oh, go man, ahead. Hiding on the towel. Go ahead. All right, right in the middle. OK, now turn it to the next seam. OK, I there you go. Oh, you look. almost got it cracked. Can I, there you go. Oh, there you go. Oh, now now fry it open. Let me Fry it open over over the over there. Over this? Over this. Oh, my gosh. OK. Oh, I'm dried out. Oh, oh you're so good at stuff. Well, that was good. Right there. That was the best. That was oh the God. perfect outcome. And there's no the light coconut there. The perfect outcome. Okay. I spilled all mine. I got, a, I I got, got a all mine. <laughs> she, oh, my gosh. That's the best. So now you have the water out of the coconut. Now you want to get sort of the meat out of it. One way to do it is to just yeah. take your parry knife uh -huh. and sort of get in there to get the flesh they out give us of the coconut, object. right? So then here we go. This one, Kelly, was not dry. I love you like? coconut, you, you yes. Okay, here you go. That's for you. I don't have a paring okay. knife. You don't I have a paring knife? I love coconut. And then again, there's a couple little cracks in here. I'm just going to pry this guy apart. Uh-huh. And then, why well, did you know that was going to work? I feel really good. Ben, you just like hitting things right now. You're just, you're I out of like control. I feel like Gallagher, the old comic that I used to do yes. with the watermelon. All right, and now, of course, listen, here's a fun way to sort of finish off a dessert. This is just some, uh, you know, auntie's chocolate pudding. I love oh, it. Yeah. I don't know if, it, if it's auntie's, but it sounds good. <laughs> uh, and then this is the way you just come over here, and again, with your coconut milk. Nice. I love uh, with that. With your coconut, just sort of shave with a, a peeler to get some fresh shredded coconut Beautiful. on your dessert. So it's not that hard. It's a little arts and crafts. It's fun for the whole yeah. family. And you get to use a hammer. Yes, you smash did. things. Yes. I love